Will they be that first team to three P? Uh, it's possible. I mean, when you look at it, as long as they got Patrick Mahomes and you got Travis Kelsey, I mean, there's a lot of moving parts. They might lose Chris Jones. They might lose some cornerbacks on defense too. So that they've got stuff to figure out in the off season, but the main pieces are Mahomes, Kelsey, you've got Pacheco, and you got Rice now. So you've got some talent on offense, and that's all you need. And you still got Andy Reid. He's coming back too. So I think as long as you have that kind of nucleus of uh, Kelsey, Mahomes, and Andy Reid, I wouldn't put it past them to be the favorites again. Although – it. See, the season has its ups and downs. People were doubting if they were even going to win a game in the playoffs. And here they are repeating. So I don't know how you, you go against Mahomes. Yo, yo, um, yeah, man. <laughs> That's funny. You said. <laughs> Yeah, I watched it on the playback. It was a little technical difficulty. There was uh, some stuff going on in the background. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, so uh, I, I, a lot, I agree with a lot of things Miles said. It's hard to repeat. I think if, you know, I think the only person that can get in this way in the AFC, if I'm being honest, uh, is Joe Burrow. I think if, if they're not going to win, it's going to be because Joe Burrow got in the way and beat him again. I think he's the most formidable opponent he's got. And he's done it before. He's gone to Arrowhead and gotten him up out of there and gone to a Super Bowl. So it's going to be him if it's if they're going to lose. That's just my personal opinion. Um, I don't think the wheels fall off next year and they're just a bad football team. I think they'll be good. Uh, and I think they'll have an opportunity to, to have, make a good run um, at a Super Bowl again. You know, I think they have a good nucleus in place. Got young players. McDuffie's an a all-pro corner. They got him. They'll, keep, they'll probably keep Chris Jones. And they'll, at, at the expense of losing some other guys, maybe LeJarius Need to walk, but – um, they'll, they'll figure it out. They're, they're too good of a team. They got the one constant in place, which is Mahomes. So they've got a, they got a great chance to do it. Probably a better chance than anybody in NFL history has had um, to three peat. And I'm, I'm not going to bet against that guy. Yo. I'm just not going to do it. Like, I, I think it's just bad practice. You're betting against that dude. Like you're betting against the, the goat, like the, the neck, the guy who we're going to eventually be calling the goat. Um, you know what I mean? So it, it's, it's not even <clears throat> close. I've never seen a better player ever than than pat mahomes in football i've never seen a better player i mean you can sit there and we could talk about tom brady and how great he was and he was great he was and no doubt about it but your eyes don't lie to you you, you see a guy throwing left hand passes you see a guy scrambling and in early in his career you guys remember he was just playing backyard football making guys miss you know throwing the ball down the field off schedule and now and now he can do it both ways now he can hurt you sitting in the pocket making the smart play every time this whole playoff run that's what he did but he can also destroy you by just extending the play and then making that throw last second. And so he he's he's so special and, and he can still throw the ball a mile right through the air, which is something that Tom Brady couldn't do. Um, and he certainly wasn't an off script genius the way this guy is. And now you're adding the IQ and the reading defense. And he was able to read defenses, but the ability to just sit back and take what the defense gives him every time and understand what's going to be open based on what coverage he's playing against. So he, I, I, look, if they get him a wide receiver, a, a dude, you know, they go get him another guy, which they're probably going to go try to go do. Um, we're, the league's in trouble. The league's in trouble. I think they're going to have enough in place to go make and run. But I think if they do lose, it's not going to be because of anybody other than Joe Burrow. It won't be an NFC team because there's no NFC team that's really eminently going to challenge them. It's, it's not Brock Purdy. It's not Jared Goff. Those guys don't scare you. It's not that as sure as that game, uh, Dak Prescott. You know, ain't nobody scared of him. Uh, he looks in the mirror and he gets scared. So I, I think it's just going to be it's going to be Joe Burrow. And that'll be the reason that if they don't make it, it'll be because he outdueled them because he's the guy. He's the guy who's can step up to him and, and make that and make it a, a you know a challenge. But I still think I, I got Mahomes. Mahomes is a better player. 